briefing by Dr. Werner von Braun and others concerned with the nation's vast space program for President Kennedy making his third visit to Cape Canaveral. The Centaur, the Titan, and the great Saturn with the biggest payload in history discussed and previewed before the President is flown by helicopter 32 miles off the Cape to a missile support ship, the Observation Island. Here in the Atlantic, Mr. Kennedy will witness the firing of a Polaris A-2 missile from an underwater pad aboard the nuclear submarine Andrew Jackson. A thousand yards or so off the port side of the tracking ship, the submerged Andrew Jackson awaits the final countdown. The president changes to a Navy windbreaker to watch the dramatic exhibition. It takes two countdowns to get the Polaris up, but what a picture she now makes. Mr. Kennedy follows the flight. The missile heads for a target 1,600 miles away. The President voices his warm appreciation to the crew of the submerged submarine for a demonstration sure to please every American.